Okay, so with the rise of the AI era, right, like uh, with ChatGPT and MidJourney and everything else, I'm sure every, everyone is familiar with the, the value of AI. So okay, let me go on with this. Okay, yeah. Okay, basically these are the three points that I'm gonna to touch about. Uh, the first is about AI industry. The second is about opening up new frontiers with a new product. Then the third will be about the product. Okay, these are the these are some data of the public listed company, top ten in the global uh, global ranking. Okay, so from here we can see that. Um, for 2023, Nvidia is at sixth place at at one trillion value at one trillion, and in just a span of one year, at 2024, Nvidia is now at 2.2 trillion. So it's about 100 more than 100 percent increase. So from from here we can we can see that. Um, along with the rise of all these AIs, AI project, right? Um, GPU itself, uh, how's it? GP, the the value of GPU GPU itself has risen uh, um, along with all these project because what powers AI is GPU because uh, GPU uh, AI requires all these GPUs to process all their calculations and stuff. So okay, on to the next. Okay, these are the this is the forecast for the global generative AI computing market market size. So from here you can see you can see exponential increase. But and mostly from not only from generative AIs but from other AIs as well. So we can expect much um See much progress in the few AI uh, field of AIs. So basically, what uh, what most people have touched on is uh, AIs like ChatGPT and MidJourney. These are all generative generative AIs. But then there are there are actually other more more other AIs like um some like in video where you can you know um. I've met some met some AI projects in Super AI on uh, last month, where there are even AIs where, which can how say um calculate your calculate your emotions. It means like they can base on how you how you react to certain certain scenario. Like um maybe let's say there's a meeting and then. They will have a log of everybody's everybody's chat log, and from this log, the AI is able to is able to provide a result on um like let's say how much from a skill from one to ten how much how likely is a person going to change their job, like like um maybe if the person is on a skill of uh is at one. It means that the person is very unsatisfied with the job or the team or whatever reason. Okay, so it's not only generative AI, but other AIs are evolving as well. Basically, what powers the what, what powers computers as currency is the shortage of graphic cards, high entry barriers, rapid movement of trends, and the lack of entry to AI industry. So, what why is the why is there a shortage of graphic cards? So, um. As everyone knows, we are currently in the era of AI. So basically, there's um, there's a huge influx of AI projects. So everybody are in in huge. Uh, everyone needs needs GPU to run their run their AI projects. And Nvidia and the reason why Nvidia has such a huge increase in their value is because yeah, basically everybody is trying to. Try, try to get their hands on their graphic cards. And what I meant by rapid movement of trends is like, um, not everybody has access to all these informations. Like, um, 
Maybe there are some insider information about upcoming upcoming AI projects which that which are not um, accessible to the general public, and all these are usually are usually only open to like uh, let's say venture capital and maybe those um those chains that that they are those AI projects are built on. So not not all the uh, Usually, general publics are not not so not so savvy to this info. But so, and by the time they are they are able to catch on to these trends, is actually mostly like um, say the tokens are mostly mined or already in the hands of those big players. And the high entry barriers are usually like um, like take uh H one H one hundred for example. H100 usually costs like 30 to 40, 40,000 USD. So if you want, um, let's say a general public, like even a mid-tier mid citizen in whichever country, it's considered quite a high entry barrier for them. And another is no entry to AI industry. So basically, even if you know, like let, let's say um, for general public, if, even if you know this AI project, like let's say ChatGPT is good, like um, the value it, it gives you, like solve, every, solve your everyday problem, it's like basically acting like a god for you. Like usually in the past, like um, when there is a question that where you, you can't answer, you ask, you ask a god, right? Because you, you just, have nowhere to turn to, and what is what what has taken the place of God is basically Chat GPT now. So, okay, on, on the next, okay, what I meant for as the new frontier is AI factory, our, our new product AI factory. Traditional traditional business model are restricted by market and project developments. So what we have is a disruptive business model, which is powered by our by, powered by RTX 4090. 4090 is basically the most <coughs> um, how to say bang for buck GP, uh, graphic card where that you can get the, and applicable applicable to most AI projects. Okay, and we have our self-developed RG uh, RM Global DMOS system, which can allow you to apply your GPUs, like, um, how to say, invest your GPU in whichever projects that you are interested in. So basically, you will get a stable GPU rental income in, like, you don't have to limit yourself to a particular project. You can, like, let's say, take on four projects with one, one graphic card at the same time. Okay, so what, these are our uh, advantages for the AI factory. Okay, we have basically our DMOS system is cross-chain, cross-platform, and cross-container. Okay, and we allow micromanagement to the point of a single, single GPU card. So you can, how's it? Uh, you can you can set like uh, which project each each GPU each 4090. Uh, that uh, each 4090, you know, uh, where, each, where your GPU goes to. Like, for example, for one of my 4090, I want to um, invest in Alio or invest in IONet or maybe in ChatGPT or whatever projects. And it's fully compatible with our, our compute swap protocol based on Parachain and parachain slot technology, and we and if you follow our our Twitter right, our RM Global Twitter, we have we actually have const we actually constantly update news like um I say all those trending news like what are all those all those huge projects doing and what are the um, when they hit milestone and stuff. Okay, and the next one is on-chain deployment. A cross-platform where, where 
like I'm I'm sure that everybody knows the like, the value of blockchain, like the immutability and uh, like yeah, immutable and clear and transparency. And lastly, is the professional service that we provide. So basically, when we sell the GPU, we also sell our uh, service, our IDC service along as well, which provide conveniency for all the yeah. All the, all the clients. Okay, next one is about onto the GPU AI factory. Okay, this is our product. Basically, what, what is included in the product is a RTX 4090. So, when the client purchase, purchase this 4090, they have the ownership of it. And along with the, what I mentioned just now, the cloud hosting service that we provide. And six months Basically, it's um, yeah, up to six months. The service up to six months. And then afterwards, you got you to gotta top up like uh, 200 USD per month for like if you, if you want to carry on the service. Okay, so the highlights of the AI factory is our core component, RTX 4090. Okay, this graphic card is a rare hardware product in the market with high value retention rate. And yeah, like, uh, like what I mentioned at, at first, is the best value for money G graphic cards that's available in the market right now. And we have our own overseas data center, okay, enabling unrestricted part uh, participation globally. Like, I'm not sure if all of you are aware, but um, currently projects like io.net is limiting participation from, let's say, China. Okay, because I'm, uh, for, for the reason, maybe you can find out for yourself why, but there, there is such things going on. So, so the, reason, the, the, the reason for our advantage is that we have IDC center all over the world. Like, we have some in US, we have some in Australia, Hong Kong, and Taiwan. So basically, whatever project you wanna you wanna participate, there you won't you won't be restricted by any any rules and such. Okay, so the last is um, ownership. Okay, the ownership of the 4090 belongs to the user. So at the end of the hosting service, right? Like let's say if you wanna take back your you wanna take back your 4090. We, we do have the service of mailing the 4090 directly to your doorstep. Or you can actually also, also like request us to sell your 4090 and refund you back the money based on market price. Okay, our exclusive advantage is our RG DMOS cloud system. So our DMOS cloud system, operating system is um, exclusive to us because it's um, like it's self is in-house built. Okay, so nobody except us has this system right now. Okay, basically it allows you to perform diversified task assignment, income viewing and redrawals. You can even redraw every day um, like we also allow daily redrawals as well. So basically if you are short on cash you can like redraw redraw your income daily. And by connecting to the GPU cloud platform, the projects, the product can perform, provide GPU rental service and connect to most of the popular GPU product globally. Okay, and we only take 6% six, 6 of the profit from all the earnings. Okay, um, this is the D, DGPU AI Advanced Factory. Okay, so basically like the previous product, Everything is the same, except that there is eight 4090 inside instead of just one. Okay, so these are our IDC centers. Like what I mentioned uh, in, in all those countries. So from these IDC centers, we have global nodes, which are 24-7 online, with prof uh, professional team behind 
for like maintaining the operation and maintenance and stuff. So basically clients don't have to do anything. They just have to purchase the product and they can invest in whatever, whatever AI projects that they're interested in. Okay, advantages with AI Factory. Okay, these are some data from uh, our participation in IO's Ignition program. So basically, this is the data for Ignition program season one. Okay, from this data, we can see that from, for a single 4090 GPU, okay, we nearly outperform all the competitors by 60%. Okay, and this is uh, our analysis for ALIO. Okay, basically, what we, um, like what I said, 4090 is the best, best GPU like, for your value. So if you compare to other, like what other companies are selling you, like maybe the 30 series, 4090 actually has three times the residue value rate. So what do you mean by RV? RVR is that, um, like let's say, okay, uh, basically the, reten the, the value of the 4090 re retention rate is higher, means like if it's, it's sold at 6,000 6, U right now, right? Instead of, instead of declining 20% every year, like every other, every other graphic cards, it actually only decreased by 10% or such. Okay, and uh, output is higher, 244 percent higher than other uh, than our competitors, and uh, our service charge is also four percent cheaper. So, if you if you how to say uh, if you purchase with with other other company and with the competitor, not only do you lose out in the resi residual value rate, you you also lose out in the output and. 4% gains straight out. Okay, and with the RGD more system, right, we allow flexible changing, like um, let's say you have you have all your GPUs invested in IONet right now, right? And IO is not earning you much. So you want to invest in Falcoin next. Like let's say Falcoin got a got a really really epic epic AI project coming up. So you can actually switch to, switch to the AI project in Falcoin in like, um, okay, you can switch, basically you can switch there immediately, but then if you, if you just switch to ALIO, if you just switch to IO, right, you have a, we have a seven day cooldown period before you can switch to any other, any other projects. So, if it's, if it's not that case, then basically you can switch any time you want. And like what I say about the, our DBOS system, we allow you to like tap on multiple trending projects at one time, not only, like they say, you have eight cards. Uh, for our AI Advanced Factory, you have eight GPUs, right? You don't have to just invest all your eight, G, eight 4090 on one project. You can actually split them up like like two on Falcoin, on two on two on IONet, two on Mid Journey and stuff. Okay, so basically these are some of the projects that that we are offering right now. Like uh, we have the pool for you to invest your GPU on. Okay, so what do I mean by disruptive business model at the start is like okay, we have we have two kinds of we have two kinds of, um, let's say, options for you to choose. Okay, the first one is the stable, the stable option where you invest in Web2 projects, Web2 AIs. So basically what you do is like you, you provide them GPU to run their, run their process, and then you earn rental income in return. So these can be, these can be projects like ChatGPT, Meet Journey, and maybe DAO E and such, those that are not, not linked to blockchain. And then for the situational is that is our projects like um, IO.net, those that are linked to Web3, 
but they are AI at the same time. And deep in projects and yeah. Basically what what are the basically these are the trending projects in the in the web tree space where you get the bull market dividend. Okay, so from this you can get effort effortless daily earnings based on realistic strategies with sustainability. So no matter which um, like which option you choose, you will earn, but it just depends on whether you choose high 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 returns with with the high return with high risk or you want low return with low risk. Okay, these are the market advantages of AI Factory. So basically, we allow you to tap on the trillion dollar AI bloom, which is which are the industry like um, which are which are which are what we get from the result of like um, ChatGPT, the value of ChatGPT, Midjourney, IO.net, and stuff. Okay, and we have the exclusive RG demo system, which allow you to flexibly allocate your GPUs. And this in return allow you to have the blue ocean market strategy. Like it's it's a win-win situation for everyone. And you'll get first hand information from our channels to get a head start in the market. So basically um, like we actually have a we actually update our community every day with all the happenings in the AI AI scene. So you you get you stay ahead of all your comp competitors. So from the client perspective, it's a product for everyone with a diverse application and flexibility because of the low entry barrier and low risk. And RTX forty ninety is considered a hard currency because like due to the due to the high demand and the low supply. So that's that's what. Basically, what um, how how you value each like how you value value every token in the market of the Web three space is highly liquidable and with high retention value. Okay, the safety part, the safety part. I think I don't have to elaborate more because of the everyone is familiar what with what Web three can do. So, okay, I'll talk about the our self built IDC data center. Because of the, um, we have equipment management and decentralized wallet assets and management for maximum security. So basically we have a, we have a wallet that can, that can hold all your, all your tokens and stuff after you mine it and it's developed by our own company as well. It's self-developed. And we also have this, um, have this function where for, for all the users to like, they can, they can invite their families and friends, and in return, they can get a percentage of what, what their family and friends um, purchase. Like let's say, let's say they, product, uh, they, they purchase a AI factory and they will get a certain percentage of it. So basically what they have to do is they just have to generate the link, their unique invitation link and just allow their friends to sign up with that link, and they will be entitled to a certain percentage of what they what they spend or what they pay. Okay, so so I would like to invite everyone to join the DGPU Astro Network to create a future together. Yeah, thank you. Thank you so much, Ethan. That was great. And thank you to RM Global for sponsoring.